I was very lucky to have spent a lot of time with my grandfather. And he started in the, in the foothills of the Angus Glens. We're now on the coast, where all the prime agricultural land is. When I came here in 1991, there wasn't a tunnel anywhere on this four and acre farm. It was pretty much one great big field. When I saw the opportunity of saw fruit, it was just like a light bulb moment. And then the competitive spirit kicks in and you just go for it. Growing berries here is world renowned. What we have here on the east coast of Scotland is a cool sea breeze, and then you have a nice cool night that slows down the ripening, which creates a much sweeter flavor. There's the minimal pesticides used now. It's very much more about biological controls. And you can see that when you walk around and you see there's just masses of ladybirds, and it's all much more in touch with nature. People say, do you not get sick of fruit? But I don't go around gorging on fruit. I go around tasting fruit, tasting raspberries or tasting strawberries or tasting this variety. What does that variety taste like? It's, it's a lot of hard work. Whatever you do, if you want to do it well, you have to be all in. But we never sit on our laurels too much, you know. It's always what's next, how to make it better. There's always something pushing you on, you know. My passion and the passion in this team is to produce very high quality fruit that does add value in some way and that people will be very happy to pay for because it's so damn good.